This is Furkan. Does he look like a boy next door to you? Well, he's not. He's very special. This year, he has been acknowledged by none other but Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth for his achievements as a scout. On 3rd of March 2018, the Governor of New South Wales, Honourable David Harley, handed over to him a certificate signed by Her Majesty. Furkan is a Queen's Scout now, the highest honour a Scout can achieve. For his achievements, Furkan was honoured next day by the Scouts of his region at the Scouts Hall on Bangarabi Road, Blacktown. The programme was organised just for him. Ladies and gentlemen, could you please stand for the entry of the flag? It was conducted with Scout discipline. Flags were hoisted with the Guard of Honour. Fellow Scouts, Scout leaders and Mayor and MP of Blacktown spoke in praise. includes hiking, first aid and knowledge of how the Venture Scout operates. One of the challenges was to purposely capsize a canoe and then T-rescue it onto another canoe. Venturer Furkan Chowdhury, you will rededicate yourself by renewing your Scout promise. Repeat it slowly as you stand before your fellow members of the Scout movement and those parents and friends who are present to witness your presentation. To present for Khan with his Endeavour Award, I would like to ask Lisa Den, the group leader at First Yungabi Scouts, to come forward. Work on that. The uh, essentially, congratulations on all your effort. Yeah, the, the amount of work, especially doing in year 10, 11, 12, uh, the hardest years of your high school, uh, giving selflessly, going out to, to other scouting organisations or getting involved in the public, you epitomise, and the scouting movement epitomises what Blacktown is about a giving society. People that are lending a helping hand for other people, and you take the lead on that, as well as all the other scouts. So, thanks for your involvement. Purkan's father, former councillor Shahada Choudhury, who is a scout himself, was chosen by Furkan to pin the Queen's Scout badge on his sleeve. Cake, photo shoot, and lunch followed. And on behalf of BangladeSydney.com, youngest scout Mark Stowell spoke to the senior most. Congratulations, Furkan. I've been to your presentation. I've seen you got your badges, and I want to know what they what each of them mean. Um, so this is the Venture Award badge. It's the badge that kind of signifies the 50% mark of completing your Queen Scout, which is the highest badge on top. And to complete this Venture Award badge, you actually have to go through and complete about seven other badges beforehand, which can be seen on the other sleeve over here. So to complete your um, Venture Award badge, you have to take um, about seven of these maroon badges, and then you'll complete your Venture Award. So yeah, that's the Venture Award. The next award is the Endeavour Award. The Endeavour Award is a badge that requires you to complete 50 hours of work on top of a specialised area. So for my one, I did 50 more hours in community service. So I was a youth helper at First Chungabi Scout Troop and I helped out with you know, leading the youth, teaching them um, outdoor skills, leadership skills and just community involvement. So yeah, to earn this badge, I did another 50 hours of youth helping at Chungabi. And the highest badge in Ventures is the Queen Scout, which is this badge over here. So to complete this badge, a Venture has to complete all of the badges. So that can be seen over here. So to complete it, you have to complete all these badges. And then the green level badges are what are known as the Queen Scout badges. So for me, I did leadership, service, lifestyles and expeditions. These require you to do an additional 30 hours on top of the um, on top of your normal badges, which are the Moran levels. And yeah, so in total, you have the Venture Award, which is this badge over here. 
and then you have the Endeavour Award, which requires you to do 50 more hours on top of your badge. And then finally, it's the Queen Scout Award, which requires you to complete all of the badges. This is a great example of what proper guidance, dedication and hard work can achieve. We wish his example will inspire other kids in the community to join scouting and learn all these valuable skills. Furkan, on behalf of BangladeSydney.com and the community, we salute you for your achievement.